Birds don't just share a distant ancestral link with dinosaurs. They are dinosaurs, thriving as the avian dinosaurs of the modern world. This began with the discovery of Archaeopteryx in the 19th century, a creature that bore both avian and dinosaurian features. Since then, numerous fossil discoveries have cemented the relationship between birds and theropod dinosaurs, a group that includes the fearsome Tyrannosaurus rex. These theropods were bipedal predators, and it's from this lineage that birds emerged. The evidence is compelling, from the skeletal similarities to the discovery of fossilized feathers on dinosaur specimens. One such specimen is the Shuvuya deserti, a small, bird-like dinosaur with remarkable hearing abilities akin to a barn owl and a single large claw for digging. These traits highlight the diverse adaptations that have occurred within the dinosaur lineage, leading to the birds we know today. Also, birds survived the mass extinction event that wiped out their non-avian dinosaur relatives. Their small size, varied diet, and the ability to fly may have contributed to their survival. Over the past 66 million years, birds have evolved into the incredibly diverse group we see today with over 11,000 species inhabiting ecosystems across the globe. With that said, here are some interesting facts on 20 of these living dinosaurs today. With its massive bill and prehistoric appearance, the shoebill stork is a true standout. They have an almost dinosaur-like look with their oversized shoe-shaped beaks can appear menacing or even cartoon-like from certain angles. Their striking pale blue eyes also add to their otherworldly appearance. Shoebills have an unusual habit of pooping on themselves to cool down. It's an effective way to regulate their body temperature in hot climates. The frogmouth's cryptic appearance helps it blend seamlessly into tree branches. It's a master of camouflage. This captivating bird is found in the lush forests of Malaysia, Brunei, Indonesia, and Thailand. These mysterious birds are nocturnal hunters. By night, they forage on the ground and in the forest canopy, feeding primarily on insects like grasshoppers and cicadas. Their haunting calls echo through the forest at night, sending shivers down your spine. a powerful and majestic bird of prey found in the rainforests of Central and South America. This raptor boasts talons that are about four to five inches long, equivalent to a grizzly bear's claws. Revered as a divine creature across the Americas, harpies are top predators in their food chain. They feed on sloths, opossums, and monkeys, silently gliding through the forest like stealth drones. Like owls, Harpy eagles can lower or lift their facial disc feathers at will. This helps them direct sound waves to their ears, enhancing their hearing. The flightless nocturnal parrot from New Zealand is critically endangered and incredibly rare. The kakapo is the world's only flightless parrot. Unlike most parrots, it lacks the keel on its sternum, which is essential for flight. Instead, it walks horizontally on the forest floor using its short wings for balance and support. These fascinating birds are among the longest living avian species. Some individuals can live up to 125 years, making them true centenarians of the bird world. Kakapos are nocturnal herbivores that feed on native plants, seeds, fruits, pollen, and even tree sap wood. This large African bird has long legs and a crest of feathers on its head, resembling a secretary with quill pens. Its scientific name, the Archer of Snakes, reflects its love for hunting snakes. Secretary birds use their large wingspan to distract snakes while their scaly legs protect them from bites. Unlike most birds of prey, secretary birds spend most of their time on foot. Secretary birds are one of only two bird species that hunt primarily on the ground the other being caracaras. Their legs deliver one of the strongest and fastest kicks in the animal kingdom, up to five to six times their body weight in force. 
they've been observed hunting juvenile big cats, including cheetahs and baby gazelle. Also called the stink bird, it has a unique digestive system and a punk rock hairstyle. This peculiar tropical bird species is found in South America. Unlike most birds, Otsins have an exclusive leafy diet. They occasionally snack on fruit, but leaves are their primary sustenance. Their digestive system ferments vegetation, similar to cows, allowing them to thrive on this unusual diet and producing a unique foul odor, hence earning them the nickname stink bird. Pots and chicks have claws on their wing digits, a rare trait. These claws help them clamber through branches and even fend off eagles. Hotsons are really loud birds. Their calls include huffs reminiscent of gorillas and wood saws, groans, croaks, hisses, and grunts. A flightless bird from New Zealand, known for its long beak and nocturnal habits. Kiwis cannot fly due to their small wings and underdeveloped breastbone. Instead, they live in burrows and dens on the forest floor. Kiwis are among the oldest types of birds still living, having evolved around 30 million years ago. They have a lower body temperature than any known bird. Kiwis possess a highly developed sense of smell. They are the only birds in the world with nostrils at the tip of their bill. Famous for its oversized, colorful bill, the toucan is found in tropical rainforests of South America. With over 40 species in their spectrum, toucans manage their body heat by adjusting blood flow to their beaks. They even sleep on their beaks to conserve warmth. A master of camouflage, the potu looks like a broken tree branch during the day. They blend perfectly with dead branches, often perching at the top of a branch with their bodies angled sharply. These birds possess a unique feature, magic eyes. Small folds along their upper eyelids allow them to sense movement even when their eyes are closed. Potus have huge mouths, allowing them to scoop up plenty of flying insects. Their equally large eyes provide excellent night vision, aiding in spotting prey from their perches. These oversized features contribute to their endearing yet dorky appearance, making them popular in memes. Lyrebirds are captivating ground-dwelling birds native to Australia and renowned for their remarkable ability to mimic sounds. They imitate everything from chainsaws and car alarms to crying babies and musical tunes. The superb lyrebird stands out with its long, ornate tail feathers. Only males have these flashy plumes. It takes about seven years for a lyrebird's tail to grow to its full length resembling an ancient Greek instrument called a lyre. Known for its vibrant green and red plumage, this Central American bird is revered in Mayan and Aztec cultures. In Mesoamerican mythology, the Quetzal plays a significant role and is closely associated with Quetzalcoatl. It is currently the national animal of Guatemala, featured on the country's flag, coat of arms, and currency. Young males take up to three years to grow their impressive tail feathers to full length. These tail feathers can reach up to three feet long. A large, flightless bird with a helmet-like cask on its head found in the tropical rainforests of Australia and New Guinea. Cassowaries have a five-inch claw on each foot, which they can use to deliver lethal kicks at fast speeds. Together with emus, they are among the few bird species known to have killed humans. When attacking, cassowaries charge, kick, and sometimes jump on top of their victims. They can leap up to five feet in the air, making their attacks even more formidable. Left alone and treated with respect, cassowaries are shy, peaceable, and harmless. This captivating passerine bird is native to the cloud forests of the Andes Mountains in South America. The male boasts bright orange-red plumage that isn't just for show. It plays a vital role in elaborate courtship rituals. Their striking appearance, including a fan-like crest of feathers on their head, makes them unmistakable in the forest. These birds construct complex nests on rocky cliffs using mud and plant materials. 
Their habit of nesting in walls of rocks justifies their generic name, Rupacola, which translates to rock or cliff inhabiting in Latin. Male Andean cock of the rocks gather in a group called a lek. In this communal gathering, males engage in competitive courtship displays to entice potential females. Now these are the skilled aerials pirates of the avian world. These seabirds have a distinctive red throat pouch and are found in tropical areas across the Americas. With their large eye-catching ruby throat pockets and a purple sheen on their black feathers, magnificent frigate birds appear to be made out of gemstones. Their wingspan is larger relative to their body size than that of any other bird. These birds are also known as man-o-war birds due to their impressive aerial abilities. Frigate birds are notorious for stealing food from other seabirds. They use their hooked beaks to snatch fish and other prey from unsuspecting neighbors. Birds of Paradise are a wonderfully strange family of birds found in the rainforests of Papua New Guinea, Australia, and surrounding islands. They exhibit some of the most spectacular and vivid ornamentation in the animal kingdom. Their incredible variety of colors, shapes, and courtship behaviors results from intense competition between males to stand out and attract picky females. Male birds of paradise often have large, hindering display feathers that make flying challenging. These elaborate ornaments make them more vulnerable to predators, but females select only the most extravagant males ensuring their strength and survival. The Atlantic puffin is a fascinating seabird that spends most of its life at sea. Puffins are excellent swimmers, using their wings to stroke underwater like paddles. Their webbed feet act as rudders, steering them through the water. Puffins have been observed using sticks as tools. In Wales and Iceland, they scratch themselves with sticks, a behavior previously recorded only in primates and elephants, suggesting high intelligence. Sword-billed hummingbird is a remarkable neotropical species found in the Andean regions of South America. It's the only bird with a bill longer than its entire body, which would be equivalent to humans having a 13-foot long nose. Like other hummingbirds, they can fly backward and hover in the air. Their higher-than-average wing disc loading sets them apart from other hummingbird species. While most hummingbirds preen using their bills, the sword-billed hummingbird uses its feet due to its exceptionally long bill. The marabou stork is a large wading bird in the stork family native to sub-Saharan Africa. This massive bird is thought to reach heights of 152 centimeters or 4.99 feet and a weight of nine kilograms or 20 pounds. It has a huge bill, a pink gular sac at its throat, a neck ruff, and white legs and black wings. It is sometimes called the undertaker bird due to its shape from behind. Cloak-like wings and back, skinny white legs, and sometimes a large white mass of hair. The only nocturnal flying fruit-eating bird found in South America's caves. While most birds feed during the day, oil birds forage at night. They navigate by echolocation, similar to bats producing a high-pitched clicking sound. Oil birds roost in large colonies in caves. They rest on cave ledges during the day and leave at night to find fruit outside. These birds have highly specific habitat requirements, needing both caves for breeding and roosting, as well as forests containing fruiting trees. Suitable caves are essential for their survival, where they roost and breed in narrow gorges and grottos with suitable rock shelves. These tiny social birds have fluffy plumage and long tails, making them look like living cotton balls. This distinctive bird is found across Europe and are easily recognizable by their blush black and white coloration. Their most striking feature is their long tail, which accounts for up to two thirds of their total length. Long-tailed tits 
construct beautifully intricate domed nests made of lichen and cobwebs. They line these nests with up to 1,500 feathers for softness. The realization that birds are living dinosaurs enriches our appreciation of nature. It's a reminder of the resilience and adaptability of life on Earth. Every time we hear a bird sing or watch them soar, we're witnessing the legacy of a lineage that dates back millions of years to a time when dinosaurs ruled the land. That's it for today on Curious Gate. Please remember to subscribe and click on the bell for notifications so you don't miss when we upload new content. Thank you for watching. Until next time, stay curious.